it mean for you to, to come back home and, and play like that and get a win? It honestly means a lot. I mean, I have a lot of family out here, a lot of people like that kind of like grew up watching me play. I mean, coming to Aztec games, doing camps here, doing like the youth camp here, always being down at Qualcomm. It was like pretty surreal driving in, seeing places. I mean, I haven't texted my girlfriend. I said like this, like it's kind of surreal right now. Like I worked so hard and would come down here to train, work out and do stuff to play at the next level and like come back as a senior and be able to play here and get a win. It meant a lot. And then to get the sack, I mean, we saw how excited you were. I mean, what, what did that mean for you? Yeah, I mean, it meant a lot. It's always like good to like play, like to play well here. And honestly for our defense and to get a third down stop means a lot. You know, after, you know, the way you guys started the season, I went to and, you know, Come back now. You're one and all conference play. Just how how good does that feel to kind of bounce back and, and now be undefeated? In it feels great. Play? I mean, winning college football is really really hard. You got to give your all every single day. You got to win. Not you got to win Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. You got to be able to prepare throughout the week. You have to give every team your best because they're going to give us their best. I think it means a lot to get those wins. I mean, we had to learn. We were battle tested. Now it's time to get a conference play. And do what we have to do. I feel like we're running out of ways to describe what Ashton Gentry does. You know, when you see him on the field, it goes through your mind. I don't know. Like, he's a mix of, like, a predator and something else. Like, that dude's, that dude's unbelievable. It's awesome that he's – I mean, we're – I mean, I'm grateful that he's here. It's, it's incredible that he's here, and he's an incredible player and one of the hardest workers I've seen, one of the hardest runners I've ever seen. How big were some of those turnovers you guys got down? You know? It was huge. I mean, we won the game by three points. I mean, being able to take the ball away is something we stress every single day to be able to get that done. And we had to do it, and it's incredibly important to our team. That first drive, I mean, they, they get the long return, they're moving right down. They couldn't get any closer without putting it in. I mean, how big of a swing play was that? I mean, it means a lot. It's always three or nothing. Like, you always have to respond. We're never out of the fight. As a coach, he always, like, preaches to us, and that's an embodiment of it. So we get the, we work as hard as we can to get that ball out, scratch and crawl, to make sure they don't get in that end zone. I know, I know you talked about it a second ago, but I mean, it's been a long road for you. And after that sack, I mean, like, it looked like you might have gestured mm -hmm. up to your face. Did, did you? Yeah, I had like a whole section right there. So it was like, <laughs> it was pretty awesome to be down here on our line. I saw my dad, saw like my cousin up there. So it meant a lot for sure. I mean, I love playing here, like playing in LA or anything like that. Like getting seen, get to see family has been with me the whole way. I mean, it's been a long six years, right? A lot of things happening. Like those moments mean a lot to me, especially for all the people who supported me throughout those hard times. Be able to see that, it means the world. Anything Can up? you, you know, there was some, uh, Andy was kind of saying, hey, on Tuesday, we're going to get to tackling and stuff. Mm -hmm. you know, what'd you kind of think of, you know, how you guys tackled it? I mean, we got to finish. We were high, we were reaching. I mean, something we just got to work on. It's something that could definitely, like, that could definitely affect us. I mean, thank God didn't tonight we were able to get that win, but something we have to clean up in order to be the best defense we can be. Was that what kind of the, the culprit on a lot of those third downs? I mean, we'll see. We'll go watch the film. I don't know right now. I mean, we'll see what happens, but I mean... I mean, we're just going to have to clean that up, make sure that we can be a dominant defense like we practice every single day. It seems like, though, you guys are getting better and better with each week. Do you notice that? Yeah, I mean, it's something that you work for throughout the season. It's a long season. So being able to kind of always improve, not just being your best week one, but how can we get stronger when it's week 12? And hopefully once we get to week 14, that's what we kind of work for. That's what we do. Just to start conference play on the road with a, with a win, I mean, how big was this? It means the world. I mean, I love we love beating SDSU, right? I mean, that's a rival for us. That's a team we really have to work for. That's a team that really, like, that's a tough team. They're a tough physical team. They're a great team. They have great players. And you have to be your best every single time, like every single moment you play them.